Hello, in this video we're going to show you how you can analyse the queries that your page is ranking for and figure out which of those queries are not used currently in the text on that page. So we're going to use a little bit of magic in Google Sheets to do this. So this is in Google Search Console. We want to filter the data on the page that we want to work with. So we'll just put in our URL. If you're doing the home page, make sure you put the trailing slash in. So these are all the queries the page is ranking for. What we're going to do is export these. We'll just do it to Excel. Open it up. This is just so I don't have to deal with another Google Sheet. Um, when I'm trying to work with the data. So just enable editing. What I'm going to do is just so I can copy the data a bit easier is just delete the top row and then I'm going to copy the all the queries, the clicks and the impressions. So those first three columns. Now within our Google Sheet we have three tabs here. So the first tab is just a little bit of explainer about what it is. The one thing we want to enter here is the URL to grab the text from. So this is the URL that we want to work with. So we put in our home page here, seotesting.com. And what it's done using this formula here is it goes and grabs all the text for the page. Um, and each element or fragment it gets is on a separate line. So the, sep the second sheet is concatenating all of this text together. So that then on the third sheet, we can do a count of all the occurrences that each query has within that concatenated text. So from what we copied in Excel, we're literally going to paste in our queries, our text and impressions. And now what it's going to do is tell us how many times each of these queries is used on that concatenated text. So what we can do now is we could come in and say, well, what we want to look at is um, we want to look at the occurrences of zero. So where text isn't used, and we want to sort this by impressions so that we can find the most searched for queries or the most impressioned queries that don't exist on this page currently so that we can go through and look see whether it makes sense to add these queries in or perhaps add segments in to our existing page or perhaps even create new pages around them okay hope that's useful let us know what you think